What's up, folks? Welcome to episode one. I'm playing today. Yet another Sonic fan game. It is Sonic 3 and Sally, the glorious uh, fan. Oh, that looks so cool. She looks so 90s. She looks so 90s. All right, what are our options? Do we have, there's no Sonic. Okay, so she replaces Sonic. Oh, yeah, this is a 2015 fan hack by E122 Psy, in line with so many other fan hacks I've done on my channel. Go check out the playlist. Uh, we're going to go in Sally and Tails. Oh my god, this is so stupid. That's the, uh, that's the B button. That happens every time. If you go watch any of my other Sonic 3 videos, it happens every time. I'm pressing A instead of B. I'm pressing pressing B instead of start. Does she have a cutscene? No cutscene. All right, so here's what we got. We got we got Space Punk uh, Sally. She got a cool... Wait, is that a... Oh, she has a sliding animation. That's cool. So let's see. We have a laser that goes like half the screen or so. Let's see. Uh, uh, that's about half the screen. Jump on C. Oh, different boop boop on A. It's like the same distance. I wonder if there's... Is there like a difference? Can I use them two together? No, all right, so let's see. C, does she have any kind of jumping? Okay, jump shot, she can she shoot down? <gasps> she can't, oh, it's like, um, it's like Bunny Rabot. That's cool, um, but why the two different, can she shoot up? No, she can't, okay, whatever. Um, does she have spin dash? Oh, she has a somersault, that's cool. So she can't, I take it, attack anybody, right? Um, no down, okay, nothing down. All right, so we are playing freaking Call of Duty with Sally Acorn. Um, that's interesting. All right, I'm gonna stop rambling now. I this is so. Oh, this is gonna be so hard. This is gonna be so hard. Holy crap! No, get off that. Oh, she does have a ball animation off of certain things. That's interesting. Oh, okay. So, so this is her strong attack. That's cool. All right, we're good. I'm totally gonna screw this up, but uh, we'll see. What's her? Uh, oh, that's a cool little spray she has going on. Oh crap! I forgot I'm on sound alert. On sound alert. It's awful. But uh, yeah, I, I was thinking. Basically, so it's Sunday, April 24th. I know I'm all over the place, but uh, I tell you, I get so excited when I play Sonic games. Like, it's just not even funny. It's just, I get so excited. I, I could be having the worst day. Like, the worst day ever. I pop on, I pop in a, a classic Sonic game. Oh my god. Like, it, it just, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Shout out to Sonic the Hedgehog. Shout out to the 30th anniversary Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, we're here now. But, uh, alright, don't screw this, don't screw this, don't screw this. But yeah, I, so it's Sunday, and I realize I really should be, like, streaming this and calling it, like, Sonic Sundays. Because every Sunday, it seems I record a different Sonic fan game just for the sake of doing it. Like, I don't know, it just seems to be the thing to do. Um, you know, the end of the weekend, it's kind of sad, so I, I have Sonic here to lift my spirits. Or Sally Aiko in this case. But, uh, I don't know, I, I keep teetering on the on the brink of, like, you know, I should be just streaming this stuff. Because why, why not? That's what people are doing. But, I don't know. Either way, we're gonna record some Sonic uh, 3 today. I don't know if there's gonna be a whole playthrough. This is a long game. Like, Sonic 3 is just a long game. Uh, I might do it in Spurs. I might come back to it, do like level select and everything. But uh, I guess there's just a save feature in this game. Um, but I wanna play some of this. I wanna play. There's actually another fan game that I was thinking of playing. Um, oh, this is gonna be weird using jump on the C button. Oh, she can't. Oh, wait. I guess Sonic could always turn around in midair. Now, let me see something. Does this. Um, Oh, she does have a super dash. That's interesting. She has a a spin dash. Then what was? Oh, okay. Wait, wait. If you, huh? That's interesting. Oh, so if you're sliding, she can jump. That's really cool. So if you're sliding, she can do a little jump. But if she's um, uh, get up there. If she's stationary, she'll do like a super gala. That's pretty nifty. Does that? Oh, it doesn't break. Okay, shit, it wouldn't break anyway. Uh, it's different. Oh, she can change. That's so cool. She can change what it is. That's crazy. This is awesome. This game. This game might be might be the most ingenious port or a uh, fan hack of Sonic. That's right. Let's go in here. Let's see what we got. Uh, okay, she does have her own icon, so that's nice. I love the extent to which. Uh, E122 side goes and like updates all these. It's like it's not like he's leaving anything. No stone unturned. Uh, can I get 50 rings? Can I get can I get a 50? Can I get a 50 ball here? But yeah, just every little piece of the oh, 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 oh no, never mind, never mind. All right, we're out, we're out, we're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. This is like more time I've spent in Angel Island Zone in like recent memory than I think I can well ever. Uh, all right, so yeah, super peel out. God, this is this is really weird. I. I I'm thinking I probably. Oh, I missed the life. I missed the life. Oh wait, I'm. This is a dead game. 
I can't. Okay, can Tails carry me? Oh my God, this is this is bad. This should not be allowed to happen. Cause this, I don't think this could happen in the original game. Well, dang. Uh, <laughs> this might be where the playthrough ends. Uh, here we go. Soft reset. All right, we're gonna do this proper now. I hope. I think I should save. I still should have my emerald. Yes. All right. Cool. Well, that was weird. Uh, Anticlimactic. I don't think that could happen in the original game. I think the screen locked. Um, right when you get to that loop or that tube, that vertical shaft, if you will. God, that's a name I haven't heard in a minute. Shaft, the freaking anime company. Oh my god, I just watched so many of their shows. Freaking, uh, what's that one show with Aragi and his sisters and all the weird chicks? Uh, that show was good, and then it got too deep for me. I was just like, nah, can't, can't live that life. Not about that junk. Let's see now. Does it still do the same thing? It was, it was like blue. It kind of glitched before. Okay, whatever. We we're screen locked. Yeah, I kind of want to change controls because... Oh, wait, what does this do with the enemies, then? That doesn't hurt them. Okay, so you're... You want to shoot with A. And then B... Now I'm interested to see what that does. I haven't tried that on anything other than boxes. Alright, and... That's so interesting because that doesn't... Okay. Oh, okay, so they both break. They both break. Uh, blocks, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. And go. But yeah, as I said, today is April 24th. Um, I don't know when this will actually go up, but I'm trying to think if there's anything. There's nothing really crazy new that's happening other than the fact that we are about a week out from April 30th. Well, six days out from April 30th, which is going to be a day uh, that wreaks havoc on my havoc on my wallet. I'm I'm leaning towards picking up Pokemon Snap just because like it's it's Pokemon Snap. Like why wouldn't you? Um, I do think it's interesting that they named the region the lentil region. Like, is that isn't that like a vegetable? Is that is that a lagoon? What are lentils? Are they just like a leafy green? I don't know. I've never. I don't know if I've ever eaten them. If I have, I never ordered them. Uh, but you have that, and you also have Returnal coming out. I I'm getting Returnal. The here's the problem I'm having, right? So Returnal, like I know I want that game. That's a game that I want to play. It's a game I want to be a part of. Want to experience freaking Celine and her journey. But I also just picked up near Replicant Numbers, and uh, because that's a long title, I have no idea what that title is. Uh, I just picked that game up, and I screwed it. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Um, and and I just started. I'm about 30 minutes in, and like, okay, it's clearly not as good. I think of a game as near Automata. Like, I think the whole brother sister story is always good. Like. Like that's cool. I can respect it. But at the same time, uh I I don't know. It just seems it seems like it's just gonna be like another like 20, 30 hour adventure where I'm just like killing stuff. And like I'm excited to get back into it because I really like near automata. But I don't know. I I'm I don't I'm just I'm skeptical. I'm a little skeptical. I, also because I've seen like some things online where it's like, oh it's not as good. I'm, I'm a little worried. I haven't read any reviews or anything, but I'm yeah, I'm a little worried. Oh that just doesn't do anything to those enemies. That's weird. Or maybe I missed. I don't know where the hitbox is on the, uh, on the thing. Can I get up there? Can I get that shield? Can I get that shield? Oh, what does this do here? Oh, that junk changes it to... Okay, so it always changes it to one of two things. Alright, Tails can't carry you, I don't think. Alright, what does this do here? Ring... Okay. I wonder if it's like all ring boxes always turn into, um... Into... Shields? What is alright, let's kill that. What does this do? Oh water fire, water fire. Um we'll take well, I'm gonna lose this this shield anyway, so we'll take water. Wow, I love that sound effect. It's so good. Uh but yeah, it's like so I'm wondering like do I get near? Do I get I mean do I get uh returnal right away? Um I have a feeling that like I don't really need returnal. Um because it's just gonna be another game that's like like, I'm playing, God, what was that sound? Jeez, sound like my headphones popped. Um, oh, that's cool. She's sassy, I like it. Uh, seems like she'd have a hairstyle that, like, it reminds me of freaking Cindy from Jimmy Neutron or something. Uh, but yeah, it's like, I don't know, Hades? It's, I'm, it's still going off. Like, I've, I've done, like, 30, I think, five runs now. Um, and it's just at that point where I'm like, yo, 
I need to beat this game so I can like put a nail in it. I've gotten to the final boss. I got to the final boss, uh, I want to say I got to like the second phase of the final boss, and then I died. And I had used all my um, death defiance tokens at that point. So it's like I know I can beat it, it's just a matter of like if you get that good roll. Uh, the time that I almost beat it was when I got the bull rush or whatever it's called, uh, upgrade for the shield, the Aegis shield. And uh, it's, it's where you, if you like release the button within a certain window, you get extra damage and it's like a plus 500% damage. That's how I got to the final boss and then I died. So it's like now I'm just gonna deflate a little bit because I gotta go through the whole game. Again. It's fine, it's still a very fun game. Uh, but I'm like, if I don't beat that, if I don't beat near Raptor Planet, I'm, I'm on the final, I beat the final dungeon. I think it's a final dungeon. Uh, spoiler alert, I beat Akira Kanoe. But I know there's a final boss, so there's another final boss in the game. So I'm not sure if there's like an actual final boss in the game. So like, and I know that I have to be, I mean, it's recommended you're like level 70. I'm level like 61. So I'm doing some missions, though I finished pretty much all the missions that are available to me right now. So um, it's a little frustrating because I'm like, I know I have to grind for that. I've been playing that game for like 36 hours. So I'm just trying to get to a point where like I've cleaned off some of the games that I'm currently playing. So that then when it's time to uh, get to the next game, it's like, oh, I'm on to Returnal and I don't have to think about, you know, did I beat this other game? Did I finish this other game? I'm playing Pokemon Snap. I can just casually play through that junk without thinking, oh, I still have near Replicant to get through. So uh, well, that's interesting. That junk did not, uh, it didn't break. Uh, break that? Break? Yeah, it doesn't always break. I guess you have to hit it like where you would roll if you were Sonic. Oh, sniped. Oh, I wonder what that would have turned into. The, uh, the, the extra life. I can't imagine it's anything good. I wonder if they're new power-ups, honestly. I wouldn't be surprised, but uh, probably not. Alright, faster, faster. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to play through a whole play through this. Though, I kind of want to get Super Sally just to see what that's like, because that sounds cool. Like, Super Sally just sounds cool. But I realize that it's been almost 13 minutes and we are in freaking... Angel Island Zone, so... Oh, she breaks the ball? That's weird. She's a ball breaker. Um, a block breaker. I, she, I would assume she could just stand on things because, you know, uh, she doesn't have a ball form, but apparently she activates a ball form. God, that's such a cool move. Like, the, it's, so rare, it's so rare, I guess, because everyone usually just gets in ball form that someone has something else that they do when, they, when you hold down. And that turns into another move if you press another button. It's just so, so complex. Uh, does she break that? Yes, yeah, she does. I like her little head tilt animation. Like she's really not that interested in what's going on out there. She's like, I'll look, but you're not getting me. You're not getting any more motion out of me. All right. So what does? Let's kill that. What is this? What does this become? Oh, that's cool. So I guess everything has like an opposite, or like something, because um, like fire and water. I assume because like lightning attracts rings, it's like lightning and ring, and then Robotnik takes life <laughs> while Sally gives it. Uh, actually, we want to go this way. Oh, yo, her reload is the, that's the worst part. Her reload is so long. All right, so what I need now is I need like a, nope, nope, just, just fall off. There you go. I need like machine gun Sally, machine gun Sally. <laughs> and uh, it's just like a constant stream of fire. Turn this junk into Contra and I'm sold. I'll pay 15 bucks for this on the eShop. <laughs> oh man, speaking of the eShop, that's another game I picked up. See, that's, okay, so that's part of the problem I'm having. I'm a chronic game buyer. Like, I'm a chronic game buyer where I'm just purchasing things because I have the means right now and I'm just, I'm just doing it. Um, I really don't have too many other things that, like, I buy in life. So it's just basically just games and, uh, you know, games, food, water, things like that. But, uh, Hold on, hold on, hold on, don't do it, don't do it. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, uh, find the big cluster. All right, so Tax Boy, nope, Turnip Boy commits tax evasion, which I might do when I'm playing on that shortly after this. Um, I was thinking about doing that because it's just, it's such a weird game, and like, it's definitely a game that I think, in some regards, kind of preys on meme culture in the sense that it's like, yo, everyone had, like, there's some characters that have that, like, uwu -oo, and uh like the oh the slay queen 32 like like it's definitely trying to be one with like me oh she can she can get low with it 
she can get low with it. I respect it. Um, I knew that wasn't gonna work, but I did it anyway. That didn't work. That's that's crazy. Get up there, and hey, and hey, and hey. like this. That was some crazy graphical technology. I'll get back to what I'm saying about tax for a second. But the fact that like the the blocks recede behind the waterfall, like that's crazy to me. Get over it. All right. But yeah, Turner Boy. It's like it definitely is like a pop culture game. I think. Uh, yeah, it's fire. Okay, so we'll go, we'll go fire, and shoot that. It's definitely like a pop culture, or I guess a, a meme culture friendly game. Like I feel like that's what they were going for, where it was sort of. Can you kill him? Can you? Thank you. Uh, it's something that I think people would latch onto and give you those kind of like bite sized screen caps or whatever. Like there's the one. Oh, it's like you can find a trophy in the game, and so they're like a gold trophy, and the caption something along like. Like, we give the player this to keep them engaged, or something like that, where it's like very tongue in cheek. Like, we know why we give people trophies and games, it's to give them something to strive for if the game isn't particularly interesting. So, it's kind of a fun little play on that, and I appreciate that. Um, but I also feel like it's maybe too much of that. And I've heard the game is only like three hours long. Um, I did, I guess, what you'd consider the first boss fight, the piggy boss, whatever his name is, and that was kind of fun. Like, it, it was. It was kind of like a like an old school Zelda boss. It wasn't anything that was going to. Let's see, does that do anything to him? That doesn't do anything to him. All right. It wasn't anything that was going to move the needle in terms of like gaming history, but it was interesting enough. And hey, I don't even have to jump over those things. I think she can jump higher than Sonic. Uh, Sally can. She definitely has she definitely has some verticality to her. Uh, get that! Get that! Get that! All right. I wonder who it's going to be. Oh, her, her orb is a different color. Her orb is a different color. That's interesting. It, it was like behind the waterfall, kind of. Like, it was like that same blue. Is it Knuckles? Who is it? It's Knuckles. And hey. Uh, yeah, look. It's like a different color orb. That's interesting. Is he just chuckling? You're chuckling. You're chuckling. Um... But yeah, Tax Boy is interesting. Turnip Boy is interesting, I guess. Uh, oh my gosh, she's Sandy Cheeks. It's Sandy Cheeks. She, uh, it's a, it's an acorn girl underwater. Squirrel, there you go. <laughs> Squirrel. Her ball form is a little, like, disconcerting, because it's, it's not as smooth as Sonic's. Oh, she has, um, her sprite has her thingy as part of it. Like, her, um, whatchamacallit. Her little orb thing is part of her sprite. That's interesting. Can that kill these guys? I don't know. We'll find out. I'm assuming it has the same properties of like Sonic's Ball, where it doesn't kill enemies who are impervious and temporarily invulnerable. But uh, yeah, I might do something on Tax Boy just to just to show it off. I want to just kind of beat that game and. It's one of those games where okay, so the thing is, this is what I realized, and I think that's part of the reason why I like to play these games. Um, because I realize, like, you can't just play AAA titles all the time. Like, you could, I guess. And I realized for a while growing up, right, when, you know, someone's buying your games for you and you can't afford to, you know, purchase your own games. Oh, no. You can't afford to purchase your own games. Like, you're kind of prey to whatever people get you. And so as a kid, I played a lot of, like, NBA games, right? I played, like, NBA Live and freaking... You know, your Maddens, your NBA Streets, like, all the sports games. I played all those, like, kind of popular titles, and not that I kind of regret that. I, I think in a way I sort of do. I wish I had played more, uh, like, just random games that people got me, but I didn't. I didn't. That's not what I had. Um, and so, it's like, now I look back and I'm like, you know, as much as I want to play, you know, the Returnals and the other AAA titles, I do want to make a point, as someone who loves video gaming and, like, the just loves gaming uh i want to make sure that i play games that are outside of what i would usually think about picking up so you know picking up something like tax boy for 12 bucks is like yeah it might suck or it might be boring or whatever but it's like it's still an experience where i can say like oh i play this i enjoyed it or i can look for more games like this or i can be like nah this game is trash i don't want anything to do with it uh, but it's tough because at the end of the day it's, it all comes down to you know time how much time do you have to actually play all these games and you know it's uh you know you have jobs you have life you have whatever and it's tough because you wanna you want to play everything but 
you have to be prudent with your time. And I just like, I'll say this. I haven't played Super Smash Brothers uh, Ultimate in about two months now, easily about two months. Uh, I just deleted it. I, I said, it's not worth it. I played online. It's, don't get me wrong, Smash Online, Smash Ultimate as a whole is a fun game, but it's not worth, you know, just playing that and sitting there for two hours at a time playing online. Like I, I'd rather spend time playing some other game. So sniped him. All right, we're good, we're good. Can I get a two, three? Oh, she kind of floats. My girl kind of floats in this bees natch. Shout out to you, Sally. I don't know if that's intentional. Oh, I wish you get, I wish you could get two shots off. Oh, sniped him. And can she stand on the side? Oh, we got that jump. You gotta get that jump. Oh, you gotta get that jump. No! Oh, I miss it. I missed it. Dang, sucker. All right. She kind of stands. That's neat. Um, I don't know why I thought she wouldn't like do the floating thing that Sonic does, but oh, can I shoot it? Can I shoot it? Can I shoot it? Can I shoot it? Nah. All right. That's the wrong way, Sally. Oh, this is going to be impossible. Do I need Tails here? Because this is not... My, my shooty thing was not working. Uh, get up here. Uh, this is not. I don't know if he, if they. Oh, it just. Wait, that's weird. I. All right, so this might be where the the episode ends, but um. Oh, see, this isn't gonna work. All right, come over here, Tails. Come over here. Come over here. Nope, face me. This is going to be, like, impossible. Because I can't, um... I have to control Tails. Like, I have to control Tails. And Tails is on, like, a one-second delay. Come on. Go, t go Tails. Go, Tails. Go, Tails. Go, Tails. Okay, wait, I don't know why I'm... So I'm, like, I'm on a delay, too. I'm saying go, Tails. And Tails isn't even there. Oh, no, I need, I need you. I need you. I need you, Tails. I need you, Tails. Oh, wait. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, that's weird. Wait, is there something else that she can do here? Is there something there? There has to be something else she can do. That's really strange, honestly. Uh, I didn't even get the checkpoint. I was hoping to get the checkpoint, but whatever. That's. I am surprised this doesn't say anything about this being broken because um if you can't you have to no you don't go low what do you do and that's crazy that tails just like off screens himself because he goes through blocks that you can't see let me see is there anything i can do uh Come on, Tails. 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 Come on, Tails! Oh, my God. I almost had it. This is, like, impossible to do. Like, I, I don't know if you can do... Face me. Face me. T all together now. All right, Tails. Thank you. Just walk through the thing. Well, that's not gonna work, uh, because I lost sales. I lost them. Well, this sucks. I need you to. I need you to come here. I need you to come here. Please respawn soon. Please respawn soon. Push me. Push me. Nope. Yeah, this is really strange. Um, I I don't know what was intended here. Uh, I I don't know why it doesn't work, but. You would think that these blocks would break the same way that, um... Alright, just... Grab this? Alright, cool. Face me. Face me. All together now. All together now. And let's go. Dude, Tails, jump up there. Oh my god, you suck, Tails. Get that, get that. Get that, get that, get that, get that, get that, get that. Get over it, get over it, Tails. Oh, you suck, you suck, Tails, you're trash. 
I'm, I'm gonna keep trying until I run out of lives, so I don't think I can run out of lives because I have this uh, thing here. Uh, the extra life monitor. Um, we'll see, let's see. Uh, we'll do one tap, and then we'll do one tap, and then come on. Oh, see, you can't disappear like that, Tails. You can't, you can't disappear. That's the, that's the problem. All right, we're good. We're good. I think we're good. Yo, just nope. I need you to. Oh no! I was so close. I was so close. That's all I need. That's all I need. We can do it. 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 All right, let's go. So it's one tap up here. This is definitely not how he intended to play the game. It's one tap jump. I get life. Go down. Oh, this is the problem. This is the problem. I need to off screen tails such that he actually dies. Because if he doesn't. Yeah, if he doesn't disappear, then. Dang. <gasps> she almost got through. She almost got through. All right. Get the life. Go get the rings. Here we go. Mad spin dash, and then land, and then one tap, and one tap jump. Uh, go? Alright, cool. Now oh, come on. Oh, I need that life. I need the life. This is do or die. This is do or die. This is do or die like do or die. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Is you, are you gone? Are you gone? I screwed it. Well, there you go. Sally Acorn. Can't beat, uh, Hydrocity 2. So that's gonna do it for this episode of when I'm playing uh, continue. Oh wait, will this give me, if this takes me back to act two? Oh, it does, all right, we're, we're, we're saying, we're saying, cause I can do it, I think I can do it. I know I can do it, this is this is it. Uh, here we go, get one. If I can maneuver Tails properly through this section, I can do this. Come on, come on. As long as I don't see, it. okay, cool. As long as I don't see the wall, I think I have it. I need Sally to just get up there. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. She can beat it. She can beat it. It takes way too much planning and time and whatever. Oh! She can't beat it. Oh my god. <laughs> she can't beat it. She. Oh, wait. It kind of... I don't know how she did that. I don't know how she did that. Um... I, I don't know how she did that. that. That was weird. She broke a block, but... Uh, can I press two buttons together? Nope. And Tails won't die here because he can't be off-screened. Uh, can I... Let's see. Can I scroll the screen, maybe? And then... Nope. Let's see. Let's try to do it this way. Are you ready, Tails? Let's do this. Uh, nothing. Okay, yeah, I don't... I don't know. This isn't... This isn't working. Oh, what? She can just slide through them? Okay, that's dumb. That's... That's, re that's really dumb, because that makes this incredibly more difficult. Um... I don't know how I didn't notice that before, <laughs> but... The thing is, that corridor is too tight for you to be able to do that, like, consistently. It almost feels like it was easier just to abuse Tails, and I realized that if I didn't have Tails, then... I would have been screwed, but, I mean, I'm screwed either way, because that's hard. Well, there you go. Figure out new strats. Uh, I should speedrun Sonic 3. What killed... How did I kill that enemy there? Because... There's so much lag on her... Her shooting, it's, it's bad. Can I kill enemies by sliding into them? Oh, her slide makes, like, a sound effect. That's really strange. I'll have to try that. I'm assuming that her boots are made for walking and uh, they can kill people. Uh, but who knows? Oh wait, is there a is there a is there a ring in there? Is there a ring in there? No, there's not. Never, never that. All right, we're getting our lives back though. That's good. Get up there. Oh god, yeah, I'm probably gonna go into like Marble Zone, Marble Garden Zone, because I can't be I can't be doing a whole playthrough this game. And oh, sniped! S give me. 
Oh, you better not. You better not. Get the ring, get the ring tails. Alright, just kill the thing. Thank you. And let's go up here. And I shouldn't even have to jump. I should have killed that through the thing. There you go. Oh, see. Wait, okay, so let's see. If I do like... Oh, that's how you're supposed to do it. That's so funny. <laughs> okay, I should have known that E122 side had a fail safe for how to handle this. Though, I do think if you just have to like super peel out and then slide, it almost defeats the purpose of have of not having a spin dash. Like it is a more unique gimmick for sure, move set I should say. Like it's more unique, but it's also just kind of silly because like why can't she? If she can do the same thing as a spin dash, why can't she just spin dash? I don't know. It's a little weird. God, that's so stupid. I'm, at, I'm taking the hardest path. Who am I, Kevin Durant? The hardest road? Oh, God. This special stage, I always thought it was interesting because the colors don't... Well, I guess they do technically contrast well because, like, one's light, one's dark. But, like, they're not particularly contrasty from the stance of, like, how the next stage is, like, orange and purple. Or, like, the first stage is, like, orange and brown or whatever. I screwed that up. And, hey... Uh, okay, and I, I don't know. I just, I just, this one didn't feel as special, so to speak, um, compared to like the other stages. But that's just me. And turning, 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 turning. All right, this should be the last <gasps> set. That speed up almost got me. All right, we're good. Yeah, I don't know if there's anything in video gaming like that's easier to me than getting the first seven chaos and was the Sonic three. Like Sonic 1, I've gotten all the Chaos Emeralds, but it's still somewhat of a challenge because the special stages are unwieldy. Sonic 2, I never played the special stages enough to memorize them, and thereby I just never got them. I uh, got all the Chaos Emeralds. Uh, I really could do it now. I, I need to just do it because I've, I've literally never played Super Sonic legit. But I also will say, I, there's no real reason to play Super Sonic in that game because there's no save file. Don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare. Don't you, don't you dare, don't you dare. All right, we're good. That was helpful slowdown. I appreciate that slowdown. Um, but yeah, there's no save file. So it's like you get all the chaos emeralds and then it's like, oh, what? I get the true ending. Let's do it all over again. Whereas like this game, there's replayability because the save system allows you to, you know, go back and use Super Science to beat the game again. Like that's kind of fun. Uh, Science 2, if there's one thing I could add to make that game better, it'd probably be a save system. Oh wait, does her other... Oh wow, her whatever beam she has becomes part of her uh, special invincible animation. It's kind of interesting. I'm sure that's more of a glitch than you know intentional, but I'll say. Oh wait, she. See, I'm so confused now because apparently, apparently she. Okay. Okay. See, that's what I was gonna say. Like something like that doesn't make any sense because there's not enough space to actually. I don't know if you can put in, I don't know, whatever. Uh, but apparently she can fall on enemies and break them to some degree. Apparently so, because she's doing it, but at the same time she's gonna hurt. I, I don't know anymore. And then that doesn't kill enemies. Okay, so that's just for terrain movement. That's, this game is so quirky. I'm trying to think what else is new. I mean, it's currently, oh, get up there. You suck. Uh, it's currently April 24th. I said the games I was going to get. What else is new? I don't know what's new. Nothing's new. We're still stuck at home. I mean, I'm, I'm on my road to get the coronavirus. Oh, <gasps> sniped. 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 Okay. All right. We're, we're going back. Uh, I'm on the road to get the coronavirus vaccine. Uh, I've been trying to get an appointment. Like, it's now open to everybody. Oh, don't you dare. But there's, like, no vaccine clinics that are near. I don't know why I shot there they are near me right now so it's like I'm just trying to get to one without having to drive 50 miles like my co-workers they've driven like 50 miles both ways uphill to get the vaccine I'm like okay like it's it's important to get the vaccine like yes but I'm not driving 50 miles so that I can uh, stand in line like come on now <laughs> maybe I should like I don't know uh, but I'll get it when it's available and that'll be well and dandy and we will get super sal can we get Super Sally? Can we get up there? Is that is that something you can do, Sally? You gotta wait till it's like at its apex. You know, Apex Mountain, Bill Simmons. 
Okay, and final stage. I do like the habit of making like the final stages a bit easier than... Because I feel like that was the same thing as Sonic 1. The sixth special stage was easier than the other special stages. And then Sonic 2, uh, I think the seventh stage was easier. But I never got past the sixth stage, so I couldn't tell you for a fact. And this stage is definitely a bit easier. I mean, it's only 60 orbs compared to the last one, which was like 120. Alrighty, and uh, turn. Yeah, I don't know what goes better with uh, Sundays other than Side the Hedgehog. It's just that perfect game to usher you back into the, the work week. Which, that's something I'm having a problem with, honestly. Like, that whole idea of like 9 to 5. It's just, it's just bad. Like, why is that a thing we do? Like, I get why we used to do it. I think it has to do with like, uh, what's it called? Um, you know, factories and whatnot. But, uh, you know, we're not living in a factory world. My job could be done entirely digitally. Let me let me work from home. This is all said and done. Come on now. All right, Sally got all cancer. Well, Sally can be now. Sally can be Super Sally. Yes, that's interesting. That Super has a different font than Sally. Uh, but we'll find 50 rings, we'll transform, we'll call it a day. Uh, I'm definitely getting hit, I'm definitely getting hit, I'm definitely getting hit. Uh, let's do, let's just back that thing up here, and we will do slide. Can I go through? Okay, I can't go through enough of this. This is legitimately a Sonic playthrough. Oh, let's go in here. If we can get some rings, that'd be great. Oh, I love this stage. This stage is so good. Like, it's just so fun. Like, it's just such a fun little song. The bass line is amazing. And, oh, I'm definitely not gonna, okay, we're, we should be good here. Who, why are you giving me a fire shield, buddy? Watch them change this game so that it's like, 60 rings to get super because on some arbitrary number like that I also really like that you can finish the stage like you can actually finish The stage like it's it just ends like you're not just like waiting to hit the goal line or something You can get to the tippy tippy and it's just over And there you go and let's get There you go Alrighty, lose your shield instantaneously, and... Oh, she goes blonde! Shout out to Blondie! That's cool! Alright, well, you know the drill. We will just stand here and... Do what we gotta do. Very cool. Oh god, 38 episodes, 38 minutes, um... So, barring that, I, I might just come back with like another episode, uh, maybe not. No, I'll just, I'll keep going. It, no one should take 38 minutes to get through two zones of Sonic the Hedgehog 3. But in my defense, I didn't know how the game worked, so, uh, I had to persevere. I had to control, had to manipulate AI. I'm basically a GDQ runner at this point. Oh, but this music's so good. This music's so good. Like, I know it's basically confirmed that Michael Jackson was part of this, but I'm like, this junk is, this junk is some Michael Jackson, some freaking Teddy Riley. Like, we're, we're here. We've made it. I actually just watched that movie last night, New Jack Swing, just because there's a song in it that I wanted <laughs> to hear. It's, oh, let's go! Super Sally, I forgot. I, she just, I don't know, if, you have to jump, tw I think you have to jump twice with her. Yeah, this is kind of cool. Uh, does her... Okay, her, Oh, it... Her, oh! She sank too fast. She, your girl sank too fast. Um, so this is going to be it for this episode. Uh, I might... I, I'll have a save game file here, so... I'm going to save up, and uh, we might come back at a later date in time with more Sally Acorn. Uh, but until then, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Have a great day.